all right y'all what's up welcome back to the channel um today we're gonna talk about is bird eating now um so as y'all know i have concerns i think she had a miscarriage um if it's all the pups or just one of the pups or whatever the case i'm not sure cut that out um but basically um i actually am going to still go ahead and set up her her welfare station for these last two weeks um and then um just keep it set up i did find something that she wants to eat i actually ended up finding some good old you guessed the chicken gizzards um so she's actually able to eat these she has an appetite to eat i don't know if it was because you know maybe she you know uh, you could eat that whole pack, baby. But basically, she's actually eating these. No problem at all, right? Now, do I know if the case was because, um, you know, she was just trying to save some food and put it up and put it away early? I don't know. Um, or if, you know, that was just, she just wasn't hungry at the time and I was trying to feed her. I don't know. But she seems to be a little bit more hungry. Um, if she wasn't eating, I was just taking her food and putting it back up. So I started back doing that, and now she's back hungry again. As y'all can see, stop getting chicken there. Why? You gotta wash that again. So, um, basically, you know, she is eating. Do I still think she has pups in there? I mean, I don't think so. From what I can tell y'all, you know, she's eating this. And she tear these up, right? That's way more than enough protein to get her right. She really don't want bone right now. She's not interested in nothing bony at all. Let's see, let's feed her. Okay. Now, um, I do have, I have to go, I guess I'll just go buy like, five or ten more packs of those i probably just buy like five packs at a time that'll be like a pack a day probably feed her two packs a day whatever all right so we're not gonna do like a because week eight would be tomorrow so i'm not gonna do a full week eight update or nothing um because that'll be tomorrow but just by looking at her you know um come here bird get up come here come here babe Come here. Come here. So, like, just by looking at her, She's still snapping at him. So, just by looking at her, the only, you know, her rib cage is still expanded. Um, but, again, she's not gaining any weight. Um, she's actually probably the same size she was before she got pregnant at all. Her ribs, they do look a little bit wider. Um, but... I just think that's because they were expanding and then they may have stopped expanding. Again, I'm not doing a full week update. I'll do that tomorrow and kind of go over like what I noticed in that. Um, but she still is like in a little coop, in a little nest. She's still doing this stuff. Um, so I'll be putting the gate up today um, and then basically had a gate up then the entirety of the all the way to the nine weeks. Um, I'm gonna put the gate back up because I really didn't think she was pregnant because she was um, kind of just walking around regular. She was interacting with everybody and everything was copacetic. Um, but she did something yesterday, which I'll talk about to in the next video tomorrow, um, that she basically started back kind of acting like she was still pregnant. She's definitely still defensive over this area. Um, and also too, he he is starting to cry like he can smell her hormones or something. Or if it's uh, the reverse progesterone and it's making him cry. I don't know, I've never been through this before y'all. So bear with me, I have really not done that much research on breeding because I'm not a breeder. I don't care to breed. Um, I just really want them to you know, have a little legacy continuation. Even if it's one pup, um, I would be happy with that, y'all. I'm, I'm telling y'all. I really don't give a shit about this breeding. I can care less. 
Um, I just really want it to happen so that way I can get that out the way and just know I have a pup out. She has a pup out there. He has a pup out there. And that's fine. That's fine with me. Right. <clears throat> so. And, and then when I try to do the research, I really can't find that much information. Um, so I have to actually probably talk to a breeder. But most breeders I know, they, they deal with, tend to deal with smaller dogs. And the smaller dogs act nothing like these. Like, they don't really cry. Like, the smaller dogs and stuff, they don't really cry when, you know, the girl is in heat or anything like that. They don't really do, like, the, the big, large dogs telltale signs um, from what I've seen uh, anyway. But... You know, that's just me. Um, so, yeah, she could she's she's eating now. Um, she ate last night um, and she's basically eating as many gizzards as I can put in her face. Um, so I gave her a few last night. Uh, she kind of ate like during the day, too. She ate like some chicken, some regular chicken, um, but she wasn't really eating. I think she just didn't really want the bone. Um, even when it's mashed up, like cut up all the way, I don't, she don't like the skin. She don't like anything. So like, even when it was pureed, she wasn't really eating it. She was eating like a little bit of it and then that was it. But I think the gizzards are kind of like a good mixture, which I'm surprised I find them because they don't even have leg quarters at that store. So I'll go back today, buy a, b a bunch. That way she can eat. I'm pretty sure she's going to be hungry from this point. Hopefully, you know, this next week she eats as much as she can um and that would kind of help her but you know uh we'll do the uh eight week update um tomorrow and then i'll i'll talk to you guys and see you guys then man take care oh and then uh i forgot i haven't been dropping that many videos on the 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 fact that i i have been a little bit busy so i haven't been replying to everybody as much i've just been replying to the notifications that i get and I don't get that many. Like it'll be sparse in between, and usually like some some like not that good of a like. It's always some negative stuff. So that's the only ones you see me really reply to right now. But um, I will start replying to y'all probably before this video comes. Y'all see me kind of replying because I am getting less busy. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and set up this cage today. I mean this gate. Once I get it set up, tied down, um, get her set up. Uh, that way, you know, they won't be fighting or anything like that while I'm gone for like the two hours and then I'll be back. But I'll see you guys in the next one.